Hi everyone, thanks for watching. I am finally shooting this video, which is for this Wonder 2 Cover Proof Foundation. It's a 24 hour wear flawless coverage foundation. And then I'm also testing out this Perfect Selfie HD Photo Finishing Powder, also by Wonder 2. Here is the foundation right here. It's a pump and I'm bummed out that it doesn't actually show the color of the foundation. So you kind of have to go by the box, but they sent me the closest color that they thought was gonna be comparable to my skin tone. It's about one shade lighter, but I do make it work. And then here's the powder right here. It's a white powder, but it blends out to a sheer powder, translucent powder. I'm also gonna use the Wonder Blender, which I have my beauty blender on standby. And they also sent me this brush that I'm going to be using with the HD Photo Finishing Powder. I've already applied the Wonder Lift 60 Second Wrinkle Reducer. I have a video on this product here. It evens out your skin tone, fills in your pores, make you look, makes you look really flawless. I have a video on that, so I'll leave the link down below. I'm gonna go ahead and dot the foundation all over just one side so you can see the difference. And I am using my ring light for this video, no natural light. The natural light is behind me, just so you know that you know anytime you use artificial light, it's going to really enhance your skin. But later on, I'm gonna show you what it looks like in natural light. This stuff is very easy to blend out. The Wonder Blender um, is not as soft as a beauty blender, but it did a really good job of blending everything out. I didn't have to move the product around too much, just patting it around. I didn't have to slide the Wonder Blender around at all to blend it out. So here's what it looks like. I probably would have gone one shade darker, just one shade darker, but it looks pretty good right now, especially if I'm going to you know, use some bronzers or contouring. It looks really good. I love how it makes my skin look even without making it look heavily, heavily covered in foundation. So I'm going to go ahead and do one more layer. Um, you can definitely build this up to a very full coverage. I don't like a lot of full coverage foundation like on my skin. I still like to have my skin peek through. So I love how this foundation balances out my skin tone really nicely as you can see here. This foundation feels really good on the skin. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing a lot of foundation, although it looks very flawless on the skin. And now I'm gonna have a little video bomber <laughs> invade my space right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish doing the other side in the same exact way. So here are two layers on the other side. And so off camera, I went ahead and added some concealer and a little bit of contour. And now I'm gonna go in with this HD Photo Finishing Powder. This is the first time I've used this and it's very powdery, so just be careful. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just like press it into my skin. I'm not gonna swirl it around. And as you can see, well, what I saw when I was putting this on, it is very mattifying. It doesn't whiten my skin. It adds a little bit of brightness, but as soon as it kind of gets soaked into the foundation and my skin, that whiteness, like the cast, uh, goes away, but it really softens your skin, mattifies it, kind of like it does this, like a soft focus. It's beautiful and it doesn't feel, you know, cakey and dry. It feels really good. I'm trying to get into like the most natural light. So this is in um, a big window so you guys can see what it looks like in natural lighting. I went ahead and used the Love Melissa Michelle palette, the collaboration she did with Ulta Beauty, and I really really do love the palette the colors are really beautiful i'm going to be giving away two of those palettes on my instagram so make sure you are following me on instagram so i'm going to go ahead and wear this throughout the day let you guys know how it looks in a couple of hours but it looks pretty good it feels good it feels like my own skin it doesn't feel like i have any makeup on i don't like to cover up some of the you know imperfections that i have on my face because i like to have my own skin peek through i'm not like a full coverage girl so i liked that this still kind of shows a little bit of my skin but covers it enough so yeah i will go ahead and check back in a little bit what do you guys think so i am back i have been wearing this makeup for about five hours almost six and like that powder kept my skin very matte but not cakey 
it helped to like absorb a lot of the oils in my skin but not necessarily like the moisture it still looks i don't know it still looks dewy but not overly dewy my face makeup looks pretty darn good i really love the way it looks i love the way it wore that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoy it give it a thumbs up if you did and i will see you guys in my next video bye